So, word around the block is that there's a new kid in town. I heard he was from like, I don't know, like Ugandaria or something. I don't... No, I'm really excited to see him. I'm just... I'm, come here. You came out really late. Thank you. You're welcome. No, really, I'm excited. I can't wait to meet him. I think his name's like Chelsea or something. Jackson's back. Robbie told me that he was moving into the neighborhood, and I can't tell anyone. I really want to, because I want to protect him. Because of... the tradition. The tradition? <laughs> Calvin mentioned the tradition! That can only mean one thing. Somebody must be moving in! But where? It must be in the house that we're having meetings at. I wonder if the list... I wonder if the list still have meetings. So, we have this tradition, right? Everyone except for Jackson, of course, sneaks into someone's house and sometimes writes a song for the new kid, newcomer, or just covers another song. And, um, see, so yeah, I remember my first time. Evan's tradition? That was a good one. We played Closer. The Chainsmokers? No, Jay and the Americans. Here you go. I've never not worn clothes in the shower. Um, this is one of the least extreme examples, actually. Oftentimes I wear parkas, heavy jackets, you know, things like that, hats, um, gloves, socks, um, you know, just anything I can get my hands on to wear to keep myself warm in the winter. It's a little chilly, so I, you know, I think, you know, why not? I'll wear some clothes to add the layers, right? Guys, something very exciting has happened. Oh, that's about my chicken. My chicken. Someone stole my McChicken. I bet it was Chelsea, and I know it. I'm, I'm so sick of the haters stealing my stuff. I'm, I'm gonna figure out who did it, and they won't, they won't regret it. Wait. No! There's two new kids, and they're living right here on this Indian burial ground. This isn't an Indian burial ground. It's a dead. But I am the Indian. Whatever, man. We're gonna brainstorm anyways. Let's do it at my house. To welcome new arrivals to the neighborhood, we're gonna hold the special tradition brainstorming where we come up with song lyrics, the tune, uh, and uh, think of all the half notes that are gonna be in the song. Usually when we do these sorts of things, we only get about half of a quarter of a way done before we phone it in and um, do anything else we want. That's a pretty good idea. How come I don't get to brainstorm anything? You don't come up with good songs, you knucklehead. Yeah, I do. It's the eye of the spider. It's the thrill of the fight. See? While they're not letting me in, I'm making some songs of my own. I think he did leave some instruments in his closet, though. This brainstorming session cannot go on. I have to stop it somehow. Okay, guys. Now that we're here, we can start writing some good song lyrics. Okay, Charles, I've already got an idea. Check this out. I've already got an idea for a tasty lick. It goes a little something like this. There you go. It's like, um... It's like... Down, down, 
going down. Uh, actually, before we do anything, we need to do video games. Let's play some video games to get our minds running. Okay, sure. No, we need to write lyrics. Let's let's go then. Yes, I won. Wasn't that fun, guys? Well, well, Luigi time. time. Wow. I think it's really hitting off. I don't think they're gonna look away from it. Oh yeah! Isn't this fun, guys? Shouldn't we keep going? No. We really need to work on the lyrics. Why? It's not going as well as I thought it would. I don't... Come on, Calvin! Let's start dancing! I have to go dance. You guys got any new ideas for songs? Actually, before we make any songs, we should just have a little bit more fun before we do that. So I think I left some instruments in the closet, so I'll go get those. Come on. I have to distract them even further, so I think I left some instruments in here that would that'll keep them pretty distracted. Oh, um, make sure this doesn't shut behind me because it locks automatically. Crystal ball here. Do you like fortune told? No. I found this at the police at the academy, and Mr. Weisman gave it to me and said it belonged to his great grandmother Ruby. And I told him I would cherish this with my life. Nothing will get between me and this. I I treat this like it's my unborn child. It's secretly indestructible. Uh, I was just demonstrating. Oh. Wicked Witch of the West, I call you. No. Mm -hmm. Of the South. Oh. I mean, you want to do anything? We're just sitting here doing nothing. No! I hate you! I mean, we can quiz each other, like... What's the solar eclipse of the Uranus? There's a trombone in here. And a saxophone. Charles, what'd you get for Christmas? Huh? I got a puzzle. Oh, fun. There's a dog on it. I bet it would be far. I hate puzzles. No. I hate puzzles, I'm sorry. Who's Clifford the Big Red Dog? <laughs> What a night, huh? I'm so tired, but I'm so glad I got my magical coffee nectar. Hope you guys got some too. So, um... Shut the front door! So what were you guys doing in the closet anyways, huh? What happened in the closet? Made some... Neat little ditties. Made a, yes, made a cool song. Uh, we were rescued by Evan and Charles. And that is the story of the closet. You know this doesn't make us friends. Sure. 
We should at least name the song. We should call it Happiness. Happiness Puppies. I don't know. Nothing. We were being pansies. While you two bozos were in the closet, me and Evan were up here writing some lyrics in braille on this here shoe. I'll read them to you. You shall never take my name in vain. You shall never lie. You shall never worship false gods. You shall Those are the Ten Commandments. Now who's the knucklehead who wrote those? We wrote it first. By God. That doesn't even matter. We have to go perform for the new kid now. Ten Commandments, Ten Commandments, Ten Commandments. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I sat down. Psst. Psst. I have a proposition. We should start a cult. Why? Because. Because Charles is a bad leader. Right. So we should start it. Okay. We start tonight. We need a meeting tonight. Okay. So let's, let's go. 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 Ooh, I sure to car pull up. Get ready. Okay, let's go. Three, two, one, go. Do not worship false gods. Do not lie. Only worship one God. Do not forsake God. Welcome. Yeah. They always scream. I don't know why. Yeah. So Ravi was uh, getting some more boxes. So he's probably not going to be here for a couple more weeks. That's okay. Big chicken! While those ding-dongs were out there making their own song, I decided to create my own. Working for my sandwich. Still haven't found my sandwich. Not going too well. That's not very swell. Ooh. Cheer up, Charles. Uh... Oh, cheer up, Charles. It won't be that bad. We can always have meetings somewhere else if we can't have them here. It's not the end of the world. Yeah, it's not that big of a deal. We we can have them somewhere else, like Evan's house. We can't have meetings in my house. Oh, sorry. Jackson's house. I don't have a house. I'm homeless. What's the news, Buckaroo? So, you, we can still have meetings here, but please don't break into my house again. I wouldn't dream of it. You did it though, so don't do it. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I, I didn't forsake you. I'm sorry. What is this? It's 292. This was my order. So when Robbie gets back, me and Calvin, we're going to give him the special, most bestest treatment, the neighborhood tour. You would not believe your eyes, 10 million fireflies.
Let out the world. I fell asleep. So here we stand. Stand proud. We're here to honor the death of my McChicken. So, don't mind at night. Don't mind at night. Don't mind at night. Don't mind at night. Don't mind at night.